So I just thought I'd ask you about the A6X2, because yeah. as you guys know, my wife always steals the smaller uh, <laughs> e-ink tablets that I get. Um, I give us like three things that you've really enjoyed uh, using about the A6X2. So, Steph was a long time user of the A6X, so she's come from the Supernote platform, knows a way around it. You didn't have that initial learning curve, I suppose, which nope. some people do with the Supernote. Nope. But uh, yeah, tell us your three top things about this new one. So, I mean, I would say the first thing that I really noticed the second you gave this to me was the writing experience has really improved from the previous model. Mm -hmm. I noticed a very, very marked upgrade. It felt to me like writing on paper, except to be honest, better. Like it feels really, really natural. Yeah, I think that when, when we talk about it's a paper-like yeah. feel, Really, it doesn't need to be a paper-like feel yeah. anymore. It needs to just be like the best writing feel. Absolutely. Not just pretend to be paper. What's a good screenwriting feel? Yeah, actually? it's instantaneous. There's mm. absolutely no lag on it. Um, you know, previously there was just a minute amount of lag, mm. which um, I feel is, is, is totally gone in this. Um, it really is just a pleasure to, to write on. Excuse my um, very rubbish handwriting, but there's absolutely no lag at all. I was saying to you before that um, I really feel that your hand just doesn't tire. You can mm. keep writing notes. I mean, what I use this for is usually, um, you know, uh, taking notes in, in meetings. And what I love with this is you can make a very easy to-do list with it. Um, you started using the new to-do list now. Exactly, the to-do list. Although you did use the star function. Do you I use did. it in a mix of both now, or do you prefer? I've them? gone on to the to-do list. Oh, I great. much, yeah. much prefer the to-do list. Yeah. Um, I've got quite a lot of, um, you know, different meetings and different things that I'm sitting on, and this just allows me to make a nice list. So it's one central list, jobs. isn't it? So you've got all your notebooks. Yeah. Each time you put something on the list, it populates that into Yeah into a central list. So I can then quickly look, you know, across all my different roles. What are the all, you know, if I've got some spare time, what are all the things that, oh. that I need to do? There's a quick, quick tick off list. Well, um, people are saying what they hope Supernote will do is actually in the notebook as well, give you a checklist, like a tick box next mm. to the to-do item. Okay. Because at the minute when you make the to-do mm. to -do item, it doesn't change what it says in the notebook. So yeah. the notebook is yes. just text. Yes. You've got a to-do list item that you can tick off and it gets rid of it from the yeah. to-do list, but it doesn't change anything in the actual notebook. Yeah. So it'd be nice to have both, wouldn't it? Yeah. And also they're going to do it. I don't, you've done handwriting recognition. Yes. But you can actually make it, or they are going to make it mm. so that it just shows you that your handwritten okay. text in the to-do yeah. list. Okay. I, I would say the handwriting recognition is, is really pretty good. Um, yeah. And, you know, it's recognizing more unusual words. Mm. Um, I'm, I'm a doctor, so sometimes I'm gonna have medical words in there and it's, mm. it seems to- it get it, those it's, it seems to get most things yeah. pretty, uh, pretty Even good. offline as well, you don't have to put it on the Wi-Fi or anything to do that, do you? you just do it. It, it. it seems, you know, there's the odd thing that sometimes you, you have to change, but overall, that's that's really good. Um, everything seems to react quicker mm. than before. Yeah, so yeah. It, I've sometimes found that, that some of the devices we've looked at in the past is just slightly slow, I guess, compared mm. to, you know, when you're looking at, you know, your mobile your phone, phone or, or mm. you know, iPad and things like this. But this felt like a, a big jump um, and certainly you know, in meetings and things that I've been in, people are looking at this and mm. saying, you know, wow, what's that? Um, do you show it off like this to go, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like the new accessories? Do you like the new case, yes. the new pen? I love the new pen. Right. I, I see, um, so the old pen, um, it had a lid. One thing with a lid, you know, you're always at risk of losing a lid, whereas this is mm. a nice clicky pen here. Mm. and. Certainly with this um, this case, this just fits on really nicely here. Now, I found that in my work bag with the previous model, the pen fell off every single time. Right. And then actually the pen lid got broken. Mm. Um, whereas this feels like, um, it feels much more like a real pen. Mm. Um, I just, it just has a much nicer feel to hold. Yeah. Um, so I really like that. So the other one that you always nick is the uh, Tab Mini C. So mm. uh, what do you think about this compared to that? Okay. I've not really used this as a Kindle. Yeah, because when you steal this, you basically use it mm. as a Kindle, don't you? And I think it's a really good screen for yeah. you, isn't it? Yeah, I think absolutely. So I'm, I'm using these for, 
for two different purposes, really. Well, you didn't even have the Kindle app installed. Yeah, in there. absolutely. The other day when I did a live stream on it. Yeah. Yeah. So this similar only really in as far as it's got um, the same sizing screen, yeah. but totally different screen here because it's color. And similar that mm. it's got a whack on me input, mm. but you didn't make any notes on this. I don't think no, no, this. I've I've purely used this as a holiday Kindle reader. Mm. I've really liked it for for that purpose. Um, you know, I'd uh, previously had Amazon Kindle devices mm -hmm. in the past, and this this certainly felt. Um, uh, better than what I'd had previously. I much preferred, you know, searching for, for books mm. using using colour. Yeah. Because mm. um, so I think you just get a much better impression mm. um, of what the cover is truly supposed to look like. I mean, I'm probably more of a book person. I do like reading a real book. Um, and I think this just gives a little bit of a better impression mm. on that. I thought it was, yeah, it's a really, really good device for, as I say, I've only used it really for that function. Night time as well, you've got the front light. Yes, yes. I do think, I mean, this is just like, such a lovely design, isn't it? The mm. Supernova, this is, this is a nice tablet design. Yeah. This is just such a lovely design. Yeah. I like having both. I think, I think it's, uh, I think it's great that I use them for two different purposes because mm. I get to keep both. <laughs> cool. Well, wish you joy of it.